Hello, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show uh, you the index and match functions. Basically, it is a combination of two formulas the index and the match function. The index function basically uh, brings the result, and the match function basically tells the index function the row number and the column number. So, let's jump right in index so it has basically three arguments array array is where our result is raw number where we will be inserting the match column and for the last argument we can insert another match function uh, which will uh, which we can match uh, with the column headers uh, or we can simply insert uh, a column number or even we can leave it off uh, so i'll show you both the examples to so first this is our uh, a result column from where we are going to bring in the first name then for the row number i'll insert the match function the match, match function basically uh, um, is quite similar uh, to vlookup it has three arguments uh, the lookup value the lookup array and the match type and so this is our lookup value and this is our lookup range match type we need an exact match so I lock the column A so if I drag it down it so as you can see uh, unlike VLOOKUP we do not have to uh, keep our lookup uh, match value in the very left column uh, index and match it doesn't need to have uh, that uh, uh, column to be the leftmost so uh, I will drag it right and then I'll change the column this is the simplest form the index and the match the index is the column from where uh, we are going to bring in the result and the match is basically matching the lookup value with the lookup array but here is another way to do that which is more dynamic this one is also very dynamic but the one i am going to explain now is even more dynamic so this is our index function and i am going to select both of the columns at once uh, from where we are finally going to bring in the results for the match function I am going to use for the row argument I am going to use the first match then for the column for the column I am going to use again another match function so I will tell the match function to match the first name in this range and then bring me the result so here you can see I did not insert uh, the column I did not insert anything I just uh, input the match function let me lock this one and then I'll pull it right Adding the dollar signs means uh, that we are basically fixing the cell. So whenever we drag right or down, the formula stays uh, with the numbers. So as you can see, I just copied the formula from left to right and it brought me the result. Here, here is our match value and these are our results so i can simply select and drag them down and wherever there is 
a lookup value available it is bringing me the result in order to uh, as this number is not available in this list so it is not bringing me any results so another function we use basically to wrap these things up if error if error function basically has two arguments the first one is value and the second one is a value if error which means that if there is an error what you want to display if you want to display an empty cell you can insert double quotes otherwise you can simply insert any text in the course like not found hit enter copy it right and then as you can see not found is being shown instead of the na error so this is how the index and match function works let me know if let me know in the comments if you have any questions or if you want me to make another video on any of the formulas so i'll be working on that and then i'll definitely be answering your questions if you have any thank you so much